Hello guys, uh, as a review in previous part I explained about mapping function and instantiation of conveyors uh, function blocks. In this part I show you the palletizer function block. In the beginning I defined some rising and falling edge detectors in addition to undelay and off delay timers. Ready load pallet is true if elevator is in down position and is empty. Uh, in this part I call the uh, initialization function block uh, because based on this code whenever you active auto mode and elevator is not in down position, uh, first of all palletizer should empty the plate above the elevator and also the boxes in front of the pusher and then starts uh, entry conveyors. To be easier, I put the same name for inputs and outputs of initialization instance. This is the code of initialization. Uh, come back to palletizer function block uh, as you see here if primary discharge or auto mode are not active it returns and doesn't run the uh, rest of the code if not it means that uh, we are in auto mode and discharge is done this is the section for uh, move elevator up Load belt is the belt in front of the pusher that stops after each uh, three loaded boxes and then the pusher moves this pack uh, to the plate. This is the section for pusher and clamp. After loading each pack of three boxes on plate, the clamp activates to sort them perfectly. Plate will open after loading two pack of three boxes that are already clamped. These six boxes discharge on pallet on elevator. It performs two, two times and then elevator goes down to, uh, to the limit and unload the pallet to the exit conveyor. In continue, you will see inputs and outputs assignments. I put the link uh, here to download palletizer and initialization function blocks from repository. Let's review the factory IO configuration. Uh, select PLC and insert PLC IP address and select the network adapter. Based on FIO tags, uh, inputs starts from uh, I2.0 and outputs from Q2.0. So the offset value for inputs and outputs is equal to 2. Then connect to the PLC and simulate the program.
thanks for watching this video i hope that it was useful and helpful for you